Strictly Come Dancing's Musicals Week took place on Friday night on BBC One, with just six contestants remaining in the competition. Presenter Molly Reinford and her partner Carlos Koo opened the quarter-final show with a Charleston to Hot Honey rag from Chicago. Following their routine, Carlos broke down in tears over the judges' scores and was comforted by Molly. Carlos and Molly owned the dance floor on Friday night with their up-tempo Charleston to the hit musical Chicago. The judges gave the pair incredible feedback following their routine and they scored them an impressive 38 points out of a possible 40. Craig Revel Horwood and Anton Dubeckel handed out nines whereas Motsi Mobuse and head judge Shirley Ballast gave Molly and Carlos tens. The Chinese dancer broke down in tears over the scoring after he spoke to host Claudia Winkleman. Strictly's Hamza Yassin faces finale blow as expert spots habit Molly told Claudia, I'm so happy as I was really nervous and felt like I was back in week one again. I was opening the show, especially on a week like this, so I just feel so blessed and grateful. Claudia nodded and added, this is the one you wanted to do. Molly explained she thought the Charleston looked like the most fun dance to perform on Strictly. She added, I have the best teacher so I have a bit more confidence now. After their score came in, Carlos started crying over their highest ever mark of the series. Molly, 22, gave the professional dancer a huge hug as he tried to fight back more tears. Carlos then put on a smile while he still looked teary-eyed as Molly held on to him. Dot Katya Jones spotted in tears in the Strictly Come Dancing audience, latest Claudia Winkleman and Testa Alley's appearance distracts Strictly fans, update Strictly Come Dancing, Ken Marsh dealt crushing blow hours before show, Insight. Bookmakers bet Victor have tipped Tom Yassin to lift this year's Glitter Ball trophy. Sam Boswell of Bet Victor said of the remaining couples, Hamza and Yovita are the 411 favorites for the glitter ball. We have seen plenty of short priced favorites win strictly over the years, and his journey seems to have really resonated with fans. They are dancing the samba to They Live in You from The Lion King. However, he added, Molly and Carlos could be at risk this week as their odds to win are 51. She was coming in at 12-1 at the start of the competition, but with her musical background, she might make it through to next week. On the other hand, Kim finds herself as the least likely winner as it stands, coming in at 81. She missed last week's show after testing positive for COVID. Strictly Come Dancing's Week 12 live show has been moved to Sunday 11th of December at 7.15 p.m.